Hi everybody, this is Sam with Python Basics and we are going to do a requested video. So the request was have an in image randomly move around the screen. So really all we're going to do is we're going to take little bits and pieces of what we know how to do and apply them all in one video. So all right. So if you have not seen any of this I will put the uh, card right here. It's just putting an image to the screen. I think it's just uh, image load in Pygame. So, all right, let's just jump into it. So, the only things that we need to change in here. So, when we first do this, we're going to have a bug. So, this is we're going to unintentionally have one thing cause another thing, and we need to fix it. So, all right, first we need to bring in random because we want to have randomly generated positions uh, oh yeah it was ran it was ra have the image move randomly was the request so all right that's step one step two is we need to change this because if we this blit was the position so Python is our image that we are using let me make sure that this is all in frame okay so we're gonna do Python x and python y and we're going to equal them to 200 and 200 so now we can just copy this and paste this here and we can test it because that's our incremental development so all right let's run this get this to show up okay there's our image just sits there doesn't do anything so now, now let's take a mouse click. So if we have a mouse click, the image will move. So inside our loop, let's come here and let's take an event and let's do, actually we need to do it after the blit. So if event type, equals pi game dot now this is the one that I've never really liked that it's all uh, uppercase mouse button down then right now pass we just want it to to go make sure nothing fails out okay so now let's the reason why we had to change this right here was that if we had it randomly generate it would come back and move it back to position one just think about it so we had to have the variables outside the loop be assigned because right here we're gonna now we're gonna change so the first time through it goes to where we had it now inside this loop after it creates the window we want these to have different positions so all right and we're going to do Python X, Python Y equals rand int, excuse me, random dot rand int. So uh, X first, it was 600, so let's do 100, I can't remember the size of it, by 500, just to say it was a large image. And random dot rand int, and that's 800, so 100 comma 700. Let's bring this over here so you guys can see it continuously. All right. So now, if I click the mouse, it will move, and you're gonna see our bug here in just a second. All right, we ready? All right, so any guesses? So this is cycling through so many times so quickly that it's reading the mouse button being down. So the simple way to apply the things that we already know is we're gonna, we're gonna create a clock object here. Uh, pygame dot 
time dot clock and then clock dot tick we're gonna slow the cycle down just close this out and run this so now if I hold oops what did I do wrong when dot quit I forgot this is capital all right here we go so I click moves clicks moves clicks moves now if I hold down the mouse button I'll get the same issue just completely cycles through but that is how a randomly we just come over here how we can take everything that we know thought it was a pretty cool question thought we could apply all our little uh, pieces that we know to do a interesting little idea so I loved it thanks for the idea thanks for the video request so if you guys haven't subscribed yet go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell because as always we have videos coming out all the time and I don't want you guys getting behind so as always guys thanks for watching stay tuned and we'll see you next time bye guys